All right. Why are they playing me up? Power can take very different shapes. But the power of knowledge will always find a way to trump the force of arms. And I hope to demonstrate that to the military in no uncertain terms. With your kind assistance, of course. How can I help you? First of all, you could collect detailed data on that peculiar structure. I mean the polyhedron. I see you don't trust me after what happened yesterday. Removing me from the front lines, are you? After yesterday's incident, I assigned a different person to work at the abattoir. Abattoir? Your mysterious colleague, Artemy Burke. I have full faith in him. I trust Burke's honesty, but his principles and morals are alien to me. I cannot be deceived. Nice to hear that. Wonderful. Let everyone do what they are best suited for. Mysticism is for the mystics, and the depths of the earth and their relics for the true believers, and intellectual paradoxes for the intellectuals. The abattoir will reveal itself to Burke, while that strange tower, I believe, will reveal itself to you. That's what I'm hoping for as well. I was just going to discuss this with Victor Kane. What? So this is what Block has in mind. Is he noble enough to disregard his personal feelings? Are you talking about Block? I never imagined that he hated me so much. Why? What did I ever do to him? I was expecting some instinctive resentment as part of the age-long conflict between the military and the Inquisition, but... But Block, it seems, would happily have my head on a platter. There, what might be the reason? I wonder that myself. For a moment, I thought he was driven by the same belief that I am. A great man, when unexpectedly betrayed by people he loves, will often seek to fill the whole universe with his, his blind spite. Yes, the feeling is indeed familiar. Does he consider himself betrayed? Come now, Denkovsky. They threw us all in the fire, hoping we, that we burn to death while simultaneously putting the flame out with our very bodies. What I'm really wondering is whether the intention to destroy the town is the product of his own judgment, or comes from the powers that be. Can a commanding officer charged with a mission like this act in his own judgment? Blockwood. He has become full of himself, drunk on his own glory. I have no doubt he already dreams of himself becoming head of the government or some sort of emergency committee. A consulate at the very least. Besides, who's to say he wasn't instructed to act according to the circumstance? Just like you and me, given the pro forma freedom to decide, but left with no choice in reality. Don't you think a situation like this would be infuriating to a clever commander like like him, who also has the troops' undying loyalty and armament such as, such as such has been shown to us? Free to surround, to die, but never to fire. Until you, Aglaya, declare that the town is saved. Understandably, he resents the situation and extends his resentment to you. I guess that's the end of that talk. So the sacrifice of, of Vlad was kind of pointless, wasn't it? We seemingly sacrificed Vlad so that we can then get into a place that we immediately got shut back out of anyway. Hooray. Alrighty, children. Let's see if they like me today after I eat some foods. There we go. I get rid of the meters. How are we doing? Uh, six o'clock. We're four hours into the day so far. That letter. A changeling's choice. I know you have been told that I am a witch, not a saint. They may have even told you that I am the sand pest itself, 
wearing the masquerade of flesh and blood. They certainly must have told you that I saved the castaway and condemned the ingenious. They said that I break the courageous and force them to submit to the plague. But let me tell you one thing. Saints and miracle workers are always covered in blood and filth. Their acts are not necessarily comprehensible to the common folk who expect kindness instead of good and courtesy instead of love. This is not who I am. I know what will happen in three days. I will be able to avoid the contradictions that keep you and the higher specs in the dark. Remember, I will perform a miracle in the end. I will perform it with the help of the outcast and the evil, Bad Grief the Thief, Foreman the Villain, Alexander the Cruel, Katerina the Deceived, Laura the Vengeful, Yulia the Unbeliever, Anna the Egotist, Aspidy the Heathen, and Reuben the Oathbreaker. They will survive in order to die, and upon dying, they will claim life everlasting. I need them for the miracle to work. Remember that, Clara. I think I'm basically being told what everyone's bound are. Like two days in a row, those two characters have... I think it was two days in a row. Uh, th but those two characters have both explained to me their... Like a list of people they need. I haven't been up here for a while. Honestly, I've been kind of happy I haven't had to come up here very often, because it's a really obnoxiously long walk. I don't know why it specifically feels long. I think it's because there's nothing to do. There's no garbage bins up here. And then no, there's no characters. There's no risk of disease or attackers so far. So it's just a very long staircase. Where all I can do is marvel in the Da Vinci Code looking building. And hope I don't fall off and have to start over. Hello. Fortress is off limits. Khan's orders. You carry sand dirt on your snakeskin coat. I brought you important news. Tell us. We will tell the others. Tell him there's a man who needed to get into the agat, agat pit. Agate? A, a, agit? Eh. It's something I encountered in geology, and even there I still never remember the pronunciation of that word. It will be as I say. Bachelor Denkowski, you were quite eager to examine the polyhedron, weren't you? Indeed I was. I'm ready to negotiate with you now. I'm ready to hear you out. We need weapons. Artillery, I presume? Kindly spare me your sarcasm. I needed several military rifles. Ammo included, obviously. I've been told they are long range and very precise. May I inquire as to why you need them? Aglaya is closely in touch with Block, isn't she? No, as far as I understand, they hate each other. So far, each of them has been pretending the other one doesn't exist at all. Well, Block has been communicating with someone, right? Has he been told as to how many children are here in the polyhedron? If you insist, I can actually mention it to him when I get a chance, just so that you know. Oh, so the two of you are on equal terms. No, I wouldn't say so. If Block finds out there are more than a thousand of us in here, he'll think twice before storming the place. If he finds out we're armed, it will only take a couple of shots to convince him. Wouldn't you agree? You're going to bluff, aren't you? I am. If you get us the rifles, we'll let you into the polyhedron. Actually, kick it up a notch. We'll show you the boon that fate has granted us in detail. Sounds tempting. Well, I've processed your request. I'll be back with news. How many rifles? Did he, did he say how many rifles? Uh... Apparently Khan wants to play soldier. He may be a child, but he speaks in a manner beyond his years. 
What could he possibly want with five rifles? I refuse to believe he would be so irresponsible as to exchange fire with the entirety of General Ash's artillery. Regardless, if it is five rifles that will get me inside the tower, then so be it. I'm... Uh, uh, three. Our polyhedron trembled when this monster was dragged in. Tell them to go away. What is my sister up to? Would she really try to remove us from here? No, of course not. She wouldn't go that far. Yeah, but the rest of your group wants to tell you to leave. It will be as I say. There it is. Once again, I was like, how the fuck do I leave here again? It's really odd because you don't you don't use a door. You don't interact with a person to like ask for permission to leave or whatever because you got you you talk to a person to get in. But to leave, you just kind of walk onto a circle on the floor, of which there are many, but that one's the real one. So apparently the polyhedron looks different to everyone else. Or at least that was the description we got before, is that the polyhedron looks different for basically everyone, but for us... It strangely looks like the, its own blueprints. Which... Curious. The bachelor is a doctor. Like, on some level, I would expect, like, maybe he thinks of somebody as their own blueprints. He thinks of the things that make up a person when he looks at a person. Although, of the characters we have, I would expect the number one person to think that way would probably be... I'd probably think the number one person to think that way would probably be the Hera Specs, because he's a surgeon. The doctor would think more in medical terms, probably, probably, as in, like, not quite the actual makeup of the body. Where the fuck am I gonna get rifles? You disappointed me for the last time! If I'm gonna get five rifles and they're not going to stack, then they're gonna take up so much of my inventory. So I'm probably gonna take a little trip to my nightstand and be sure to drop off hello I helped you're welcome ooh pills pills here he's the patrolling one they didn't have the barter option alright that was an accident whoops Accidental dub cl double click. It's so easy to click with this mouse, and every now and then I'll have a little tiny finger spasm where I accidentally double click it because the action, the actual action of clicking, is so small. I'm like, oh, okay. Well, I guess I did that. Good job, me. Oh, there's still strange children in my house, which is not my house. No, nope, but you're still here, whoever you are. All right. What a developed character. <laughs> Every time I talk to her, she's just like, Hi. I have a headache. Okay. Are you also gonna say you have a boyfriend? <laughs> okay, wow, that's a lot of lockpicks. Th that one's over- there's one over there, too. I'll just hold on to one for now, because I've never used a single one. I really did trade for way too many of them. I just thought they'd be more useful. They probably have- been, they probably are plenty useful if you actually... Like, plan on doing a bunch of burglarizing. But I kind of thought that maybe I would just encounter more, like, actual locked things just in my way in general. I'm just used to, in, a, in an RPG, uh, a lockpick just being a pretty much universally useful object. Fuck. Hey, guys. Help. I need to cross this bridge. And... Oh, he just stopped. Alright. Cool. Uh. Oh, he's gonna be in trouble in a moment here. I'm not actually sure that there even is a single infected... No. God damn it, why do I keep thinking that? There's one to the far north. I just keep forgetting about it for some reason. It does feel like most of the map is either neutral territory or criminal... Filled territory. 
like violence in the streets, but not so much the other options. I'm used to being I'm used to there being more plague areas, but I can only there's only really one area that I remember being plaguey. Oh. Guess y'all are fine. This guy's still in here? People are talking about him like having a new fire lit in his soul. He's so great. Hmm. Just for here for the map. Thank you. Where did those li Ah. No, there's a lot of infected areas, specifically the uh, previous island, which I've been spending less time on. That's why it feels like it's mostly criminal area, because I've been I've been going between these three spots a lot, with this being the one infected p place I was familiar with. And then I was going around in here, which is also all burned out criminal zones. So no, it's uh, it's about as much infection as normal, maybe even more. But it's just in spots that I mostly haven't had to travel through. Well, he wasn't much for much for conversation. Uh, grief is a good idea, probably. Uh. Wow, I really went the wrong way here. This is this is an annoying wall that I'm not used to even seeing. Can I walk up this? Nope. I think grief might be a decent source of weapons. If I don't know where else to get one. I don't know what the deal is with soldiers. The first soldiers I fought didn't drop anything. The next soldiers I fought all dropped weapons. And I don't really know what the difference between them was. Oh, it got me. Shit. Whoopsie. That's not a good time. I can hear it, like, right next to me, but I don't see it. it bothers me. You know what? You know what? It's not worth it. Fuck it. Fuck this place. Yeah. Uh, it finally happened. Oops. It finally happened. My happy place where I get all my loot is is uh, infected. I was going. To, I was trying to visit grief. I need, I need weapons to recede, and grief has a tendency to have weapons. Probably a good place to start. That's a lot of dudes. A lot of dudes. Uh. I heard a whooshing noise, so I thought I was about to be under attack. But at the same time, my path forward was blocked. Not a good mix. Aha. This little alleyway is safe, but the entirety of grief's- okay. So yeah, it's a good idea for me to skirt the outskirts over here. Instead of going inside that mess. It's full of plague. God damn. Guys keeping busy? Jesus. That's a lot of gunshots, frankly. It's really concerning. <laughs> this month's train was fat and fancy. First class stock. My compliments, good doc. Shell out the cash and we'll show you the stash, eh? <laughs> oh, hey, your artillery mortar arrived. Doc, the one you're getting for free? Go get it. Yeah, so I've come to see the goods, Grief, of a smaller caliber. You have a rifle. Fucking expensive rifle, and it's not even enough for what I need overall. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. There's the sh there's the pistol alert too. Man, even a bullet costs like a thousand. Scary.
I still need two more. I don't know. We'll see if I can find a better price. Or even find another source. The fact that he only sells one makes me think that there's places to find more of them. Because he doesn't single-handedly offer enough to solve the quest. I'm thinking there must be other ones you can find elsewhere on the map. And if I can get those ones, probably won't cost me 15 grand. We go exploring. I want to see what I could find. We saw a train coming in. Let's go exploring. When all the bad guys showed up, we saw a train coming in. Which might mean that they have, like, a weapons train? For all their equipment? Because otherwise, where the fuck am I supposed to manifest this many- Ooh. That's probably it. Because I'm thinking, like, how, how am I supposed to manifest so many goddamn weapons out of thin air? There they are. They're clearly guarding this. That's the one the little kid's in over there. They're gonna attack me on sight, right? Is there a better one to try? <laughs> oh my god. Alright. Damn. That's a lot of crybaby sounds in rapid fire. Well, they're clearly guarding something then. Look at that response I just got. God damn. I need rifles. Admittedly, part of me kind of wonders. Like, what if you could get them from the commander? But surely he wouldn't sell you rifles. Or even give you rifles if you ask for them. Seems like a bad idea. That was a lot of cry sounds. What? Those ones, give me those ones, what the fuck? Wait, there's so many rifles here, what the fuck? Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give Why can't I have the rifles? There's so many rifles in here, what the fuck? This is like bordering on a plot hole right now, why can't I get those rifles? What? Although they weren't guarding that one, it's not fair. Thanks, game. Jesus, what am I gonna do? There's so many of them. I mean, they all saw me instantly. There's so many of them. What the f- is there a distraction item in this game? I don't think there is. Fuck it, I'm running! Nope. God damn. They don't want me in there. I don't know if this is feasible. I don't know if I can do this. Shit, where am I gonna get the rifles? The only- the only other source I know is Grief, but Grief only has one rifle. <laughs> Their aim is so good. The other side's not much better, apparently. What if there's like a really dumb approach? What if I- what if instead of crawling towards the ramp, I can crawl up to the door and then activate it from downstairs? That'd be pretty funny. Shit, there's no door. And they saw me instantly. There's no door up there? Fuck. Fuck. I thought at least I'd be loading into a different zone when I- when I'm getting the rifles. Nope. They're, uh, they can still shoot me while I'm getting the rifles. It's not a separate zone like the other 
train was. I need this shit to work. Then go up here. Excuse me, guys. <laughs> Alright, wow. What's the hitbox on this thing? That's as close as I can get. What the fuck? Does that guy attack me too? First of all, what's that gun even for? Also, is it on my map? Nope, military's not on the map yet. Wow, he notices you very quickly. Can I climb? Nope, I can die. No, Mr. Bond, I expect you to die. Very abruptly. Okay, so that guy is positioned really close to the back, so even any attempts at trying to do any tricky platforming, it doesn't do anything because he just turns around the moment I stand up. When I am no longer in stealth mode, I guess. As if crouching affects my detectability in this scenario. But this side? Look! Alrighty then. Ooh. 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 No? You can't see me, I'm invisible. Shit. Oh, that was working. That was working. The question is if I stay crouched once I'm up there, will he notice me? Because I almost got up there without him. What happens, I slid forward a little bit, and then because I was standing, he noticed me. But I don't think that guy normally noticed me when I snuck around the corner. It was the guards. Maybe being up here will avoid the guards noticing me? If I just crouch correctly? I like how he just gives up and goes away. Also, my reputation doesn't even take a hit. That's weird, right? Honestly, not sure how the AI works with these guys. How was I doing that? I was just doing it. What? It was working every single time, and now it's suddenly not working ever. What was that? How is that working? Why can't- it, why can't the bachelor climb small ladders? <laughs> There's a ladder right there. Come on, I want to use my speedrun hacks that I discovered. I just did this. Game. Ooh. 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 <laughs> it's so close. Quick save. Sneaky, 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 sneaky. Uh, this'll totally work. Shit. <laughs> Super doesn't work.